Pokemon. It's what's for dinner. Even though I had already some chicken. Oh well, so much for that. Hey, how's it going guys? My name is Orlando Balao Jr., but you may call me Lando. And like last time, I had some Pokemon cards. And guess what? I've got some more. I have some more Pokemon cards to unwrap. And the reason I am unwrapping some Pokemon cards in this episode is because, well, there really wasn't much for me to talk about. And so I decided I'm just going to open up another one of these. And this is a brand new guy that I got. Um, like the last one, I got the uh, Mimikyu for a pin. And this particular one, it is a, can we get a good image of this one? A Suicune. Yeah. Suicune is here. That blue legendary dog of a Pokemon is here. Now last time I actually had it upstairs in the other room and this time I have it back downstairs where I want to be, where I need to be, where I better be put in my place. This is the place where I'm meant to be. So I am going to unwrap these and there's going to be a better vision of how these are going to look. So without further ado, let's open this thing. I've been waiting since a couple days to try and open this thing. So here we go. I gotta, I gotta try to open it again because, you know, I just hate them. I just love it when that happens. They, oh, great. Okay, oh, there's a part right there. Found an edge, found an edge. Still trying to get this to open ever so slightly. Be gone with you. Let's open up Suicune, shall we? Let's. Here he is. A little Suicune pin. Maybe he could be as big as me. I, I don't know. Can I can I bite into him? He could be as big as me. Big as my head. What's that you got there? <laughs> Ew. Tastes like legendary. And I can't do legendary. Enough of that. Let's open this up. Let's see what we got here. Okay. So we have three, three of these guys to choose from. We've got the sun and moon, which is what I've been trying to collect. But I also noticed there's a uh, evolution. XY and a XY Steam Siege. Steam Siege. This, uh, this guy kind of looks pretty cool. I, can't, I You know what? I'm gonna have to open him because I don't know which Pokemon this is, but it's kind of it's kind of awesome. So I'm opening this one first. All right. So here we go. Ah, the top part. There it is. Here's how it's done, son. I'm just gonna open it up like. I'm just gonna open it up like. Just, Okay, it's not opening. All right, fine. You win. I'll open it up just the way you want me to. Okay, so here's our first Pokemon, um, a Balloon-type Pokemon named Drifloon. Drifloon? Is that the guy? Yeah, Drifloon. Okay, yeah. Um, Psychic-type, Balloon-type Pokemon. Uh, yeah. These Pokemon are called blah, 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 blah. Here's a Pokemon that I'm aware of because he was from second generation, and he was a lightning Pokemon, Mareep. Did I say that right? Mareep? Mareep what you sow. <laughs> Get it? Cause I... We also have here a Fletchling. Fletchling. It's a colorless Pokemon. And a tiny Robin style Pokemon to add to that. Isn't this kind of nice that I can actually put it this close up and not this far up that you have a picture on the side there? This is really nice. Better imagery. Another second generation Pokemon by the name of Yanma. Not to be confused with Yamcha. Here's one that got my attention. What is this? It's it's Meryl. Aqua Mouse Pokemon, but I'm not familiar with this color. What symbol is that? Is that a fairy type? I have no idea. But it's not psychic, but it's something. Uh, we have another Pokemon by the name of uh, Nuzleaf? Nuzleaf. I think this one might have been third generation because he's number... 274. So, there's that character. We also have a couple trainer cards. We have the Armor Fossil. You get a good image of that, kids? Armor Fossil trainer card and a Pokemon Ranger trainer card. Okay, now here are the shiny ones. We have a Rufflet. A little Rufflet. Doesn't look like a common, it's very common, I guess, but it's shiny. And our star Pokemon of the day goes to Chandelure. Chandelure. Psychic type Pokemon, alluring Pokemon. Not to be confused with Chandelier, because Chandeliers, even though they float in the air or hang in the air, this particular one seems to be all over the place. The spirit burned up by its ominous, ominous 
flame lose their way and wander this world forever. Forever and ever. Okay, who's next? Well, we gotta go with the XY. Mr. Charizard here wants to play. Well, you can't play yet. We gotta open you up first before we can just go out and play. Do you know how this works? Do you know what I am? What, what the hell? I remember you. I know you, you, and you, and you, and you. Oh, I know you guys. Oh, I don't know you. It looks like the Evolution XY is bringing me back to my roots with the Diglett. I remember that Diglett. I remember this Ghastly. I remember them. I, I was told that these particular ones are stronger than they were for my old Pokemon cards. You know what? I've got my Pokemon cards here right now. We are actually going to look at these and we're going to compare. Or at least I'm going to. I don't know about you guys, but stick around. Okay, so let's look at Diglett here, which was a mole Pokemon. He was number 50. Okay, believe it or not, I got my cards. Aha! I got my cards. I got my cards. You guys want me to do another video where I can where I talk about these cards? And believe it or not, this is only one book. I have three more of these. Three more. Diglett is a mole Pokemon. Yeah, he's definitely different. If we can compare the two, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna do what 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 they normally don't tell me to do. I'm gonna pull out. Phrasing. Oh wow, they're definitely different in comparison. One has a little more graphics than the other, but both, well, yeah, they definitely have different hit points. And one is just slightly, has a little more HP than the other, different attacks. And one of them's got a little more shading than the other. Either way, they are practically the same. What about Ghastly here? I mean, I know that Ghastly, I mean, I could go on these things forever, but... Yeah, the Ghastly on this one has higher HP by about 10, and just a little different than the others. You know, I'll show you, I'll show you, and then that's it. I'm, I'm going to continue on, I'm going to move on. Like life, you got to move on on things. Compare and contrast, kids. Different high HP, and of course different hit points like the other, like the last one. And his resistance is different, he's weak against dark type. Weak against the darkies. That was racist. Back to the program. We've got a Caterpie, basically the way he ought to be. We got a Drowsy, just the way he should see. We got a Magikarp, and he don't really give a f farp. Ooh, this is cute. <laughs> Show you later. Arcanine, Arcanine. It's Van, it's the Arcanine. He will beat the shit out of Charizard with that hit. Metapod, 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 Metapod. Uh, we got that colorless energy. Cute, cool, nice, awesome. A trainer card of Charizard Spirit Link. That's cute. I don't know how it works, but uh, yeah, yeah. That's just how it's done. Oh, oh shoot, you dropped, you dropped. Man down, man down. Crisis averted, he's gone, he's gone. Fight crisis averted. Everything's all right. Charizard, trainer card is safe and sound from where it once came from. That makes sense. Anyway, Haunter is all shiny. Oh, no, 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 no. It's kind of trippy. Look at that. Hey, one more to go. And it's Mr. Sun and Moon himself. The cards of the Sun and Moon are oh, yeah. To be open, to be unraveled. How did something that was made from trees and turned into pieces of paper become so valuable? Because we made it that way. Oh, I got this one before. Lollipop. Did I get him before? I'm pretty sure I got him before. Bound Sweet, the fruit Pokemon. Can we get a good image? I don't even know. There it is. Yeah, ain't he cute? Oh, Dupiter, Dupiter, the Dupiter. I've had Dupiter before. And then Dupiter right there. You know, I would be very surprised if I find out, like, oh, Dupiter is who he is, and he finds out he's a really intelligent Pokemon, and these little claws that he's getting right there, he looks like he's flipping me off. Look at that. It's like he's telling me, hey, you, up yours, man. You think I'm stupid? Man, shut up. Kick your ass. We have, uh, oh. Oh, that looks so, oh, that looks really sad. It's a, Marini? 
Marini Pokemon. Oh no, Marini, which is the Brutal Star Pokemon. It looks so sad. Just look at it. Oh. I want to give you a hug. If you didn't have all these spikes, you'd probably stab my ass. It plunges the poison spike on its head so it into its prey. When the prey has weakened, Marini deals the finishing blow within with its ten tentacles. Oh, I see fangs. Yeah, you're not so cute after all. Are you, Miss Marini? Bitch. But this one looks kind of cool. It's a flailing Pokemon of Stuffle. Stuffle? Yeah, Stuffle. That's his name. That's his name. Don't wear it out. Masquerade. Masquerade. Masquerade is the eyeball Pokemon. Uh, I guess if you put it together, yeah. Its wings and antenna don't cope well with moisture. After a rain, it faces a sunward to dry off. Okay. And it's a star type. Oh, I got a star type in my hand. <sighs> like as if I bought it out of a Pokemon card pack. Duh! Now we got an energy card. Leaf energy card. How cute, how nice, how sweet. How are you? <laughs> Good, because his name is How. Is then how the hell did we make sure that we didn't make fun of this scene? You know. Like, how the hell did you... How the hell? How? how? Another a diamond type. A couple diamond types. Man, you are messed up. This is a Lolan Radicate. Look at this thing. You, this is when you know you've eaten way too much. When you become this vicious. This is gluttony at its best. This is like, wow, just look at this little shithead. <laughs> Like, he ate way too much. Like, Thanksgiving is every day. Every day is Thanksgiving. I'll shit on your ass. You tell me to go on a diet, I'll kill you. I'll kill all of you. That's how Eradicate would sound like if he was in the Alola area. Now, why you got it? Why, what's up with these small, what's up with these crying types? Wishy-washy. Wishy-washy. When it's in trouble, its eyes moisten and begin to shine. The shining light attracts its comrades and they stand together against their enemies. So, I, I guess this is a very coward-like, I don't know, very sensitive? I don't know. I have no clue. All I know is it's a water Pokemon. Its name is Wishy-washy and it's all cried. It's all teary-eyed. <gasps> Why does anyone love me? Why don't you love me? Out of focus. And of course the last shiny type. It's a kick-ass Pokemon, one of the most awesome ones. It's that Stag Beetle Pokemon from Generation 1. His name, give it up for Pinsa. And he's also shiny. A shiny, shiny, shiny. Maybe not as psychedelic as the last one, cause I can see the leaves. He's not as psychedelic like Haunter, but he's still cool. I don't have a rhyme, but I have rhythm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. My name is Pinsa, 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 Pinsa. Boom, boom, boom. Oh yeah. Stop making me look like a cool land. Oh sorry. But that's about it. That's all I have. Um, I hope to try to make more videos in the future to come. But until then, I hope you enjoyed this one. Um, I hope these cards are of, are of value. Let me know in the comments below, because I don't have a clue. I'm an old man, kids. I'm an old man. And I really am not too sure how well these Pokemon cards are now. So you have to help me out. But thank you guys so much for watching. I will have more content to come in the future. But until then, you guys take care. And as always, rock on.